No sleeping on the job, Mario! Eee! Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. So, oh man. <laughs> so this unlocks a place that, well, you could probably guess that I don't like very much. Because you know my feeling when it comes to boss rushes. Battle Belt Galaxy, yeah? It's a boss rush place. Always, always tacky. Mini Planet Mega Run. Well, I shouldn't say it's always tacky. It's, it's only really tacky when it's just repeats on top of repeats that you already did before without really variation to, to it. Uh, although, maybe this isn't the one that has the boss rush in it, though. Well, mm, well, we're here. We'll, we'll see how things roll here, including this planet. Yeah! There we go. By the way, memorize this place later on for a speed run later, because we're gonna have to we're gonna have to redo stuff later. Let's just put it that way. And uh oh, uh oh, cinders, little cinders, comet metals. That's what we are getting. Uh, uh oh, uh oh, a sign. Hey, whoa! You made it all the way here. I know. You know, the only way through here is to defeat any enemy, every enemy, right? Okay, so maybe this isn't the boss rush one that I was thinking of, but oh, there is. Well, certainly a boss rush coming, and it's on this galaxy, I remember it. And I'm gonna be cursing the day that I started this game. <laughs> oh, you fell back in, you stinker. Alright, just gotta get you far enough away, I guess. There you go. So I yeah, just gotta clear out all the planets of enemies, and they're, they're pretty small planets, so not really that big of a deal or anything like that, and I love their faces. <laughs> yeah, baby. Woo. Um. Uh. Let's just see what else is on this planet for kicks. This is a little bit larger than the other ones. Uh, okay, we're good. Unless you want to grab that coin. Ah, uh, just. Uh, oh, 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 oh. oh, dang it! You and your powerful shieldings. You and your speedy movements. The blue one's actually speedier. <laughs> You gotta make them guard so that they stop moving as fast, and then you go around back. There you go. And then you you take them to the cleaners. Got a one-up for that for some reason. Guess because it's the, the special blue crabber. Uh, is that really all there is on this beach planet? I guess so. I guess so. Oh boy. Captain Toad ship, or one of his ship branches is here. Oh man, why are you so scared? You're inside the safety of your ship. I'm searching for the captain, but there are enemies everywhere. Well, just stay in the ship and just fly around the planet. You'll be fine. I, I assure you, you'll be just fine. Well, you can actually move the camera around this place with your movements, unlike the other ones. Eyeball star bits. Not bad to get that many star bits, I guess, but not as good as the Pac-Man slash Chomp star bit. <laughs> uh, oh, no, 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 oh, oh, oh. I'm on, I'm on a pumpkin. And, oh, there we go, I got the key. Well, I, I mean, I got the key from killing all the enemies, but it was not straight from that enemy. <laughs> We're inside the pumpkin! Yeah! Man, this looks a lot... A lot, lot different than you would expect on, on the inside here. I mean, I don't think pumpkins are this moist. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta point our light beam at the booze. Yeah, how do you like those apples? It's gotta be on them for a decent amount of time, otherwise it doesn't doesn't really work, though. Because, you'll see, I just passed the beam over a couple of them there, and it because it went so fast, it didn't really work to vaporize them, but if you just get just get in a little a little bit slower than that, you'll be able to vaporize them. And oh incoming boss. Not not a boss rush boss. Uh, I think I'll actually I'll actually do that. Because this boss could give me some ire in some places if it's if it's gonna keep chain attacking me. It's a fiery thing. Oh, so good. Gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> I don't really think I'll need it, probably, but just in case. Oh shoot, that was. Uh, well, hmm. Actually, you know what? Because I hit that checkpoint back there. Yes, there is a secret star here too. Uh, whoops. I, I just wanna. Mm, I was gonna say I wanna get killed off, but that that's gonna take forever, actually. Right? Hmm. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll just. 
<laughs> Maybe I'll come back to that when I do the secret star. <laughs> but, uh, okay, let's just see ahead of time how many coins I'll actually need. 20 of them, huh? Nah, I don't have enough. But okay, so I'll, I'll be back to that other toad in the other brigade ship e eventually. So we'll be okay in the meantime, I suppose. Uh, moles? Oh, man. Well, that's not what I was going... <laughs> <laughs> That's not what I was going to show there. There we go. Yeah, you want to you want to ground pound next to them, not necessarily on top of them, and that'll kind of shake them out of their spots. There we go. And this planet looks like that they've been uh, they probably weren't, weren't digging for all that long. So I think we saved the environment here because they would have buried that grass or mixed the grass in with their other with their other trimmings of the ground and whatnot. Uh, Man, they're just not environmentally conscious, are they? Alright, moving on. Oh, jeez. This is gonna be dizzy, isn't it? Oh, it's flipping the... I, sh I shouldn't have jumped the gun, that's right. Yeah, it does this thing. Pop, 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 flip. There we go. Pop, pop, pop. And we're out of here. <laughs> uh, actually, just take a look, see around. Some little grass particles. Can I get in that? Well, the gravity's flipped, maybe. Maybe, with some wall jumps or something. I don't know if it'll accept me with the gravity, though. Because the, gra the gravity's not letting me stand on top of it directly. Hmm... Well, there's a star in there. The silver chomps. There's green things. <laughs> Do the math. <laughs> yeah, those silver chomps, they're like guard dogs. <laughs> the stars and stuff like that, I swear. And one more to go. There you go. <laughs> I'll take a look-see around the planet, though. I like how they flatten our greenery in here, though. They, they come back to life, though, you know, after they... Uh, after they just have a little time to recover, so... No environmentally uh, destructive properties of the chomps here. Unlike the bowls, but, uh, well... <laughs> They, they still have their dangers of their own to the to a plumber's life. <laughs> Woo! All right, so secret star. We're going back for it right away, I, I guess. <laughs> Woo! Yeah. Yeah. One hundred anniversary with the comet medal to boots. All right. Oh, oh, comet. Oh no, com not a comet, it's an alternate path leading to... Oh, there's a comet there, but... <laughs> I'm feeling too committed to go back to throwback right now. Because I want to see what is the other star. Uh oh, letter. Challenge! Race! Race! Showdown! And fleet like delicacy! Come on, go on, on! Yep, there's another star unlocked over there, too. So you got two stars waiting for us at two other galaxies. Oh boy! But first, since we're here, Battle Belt, Secret Star, is a go. And I believe it'll have to do some... I, I don't remember the name of it, but... I believe it'll have to do with a special super secret bossy boss. It's the Mini Planet Mega Run that is not the Mini Planet Mega Run. We've got to get coins before we reach the Hungry Luma. So we're going to jump on enemies rather than spin on them if at all possible, as well as, you know, break apart the rocks and stuff like that along the way. Like, I'm gonna be carefully looking around, rather than spinning into the Goomba, I'm just gonna, just gonna jump on it. Just gonna, you know, just, it may be a little more tricky to jump on a Goomba in 3D, but it's more useful to do that when I'm trying to collect coins for the bottom line. It's all about the capitalism. Yes! Don't you just turn into a... Yeah, you turn into a coin if I just kick you, so... You will be easy to get coins from. <laughs> Good thing I know the enemy properties pretty decently. Does a Comet Metal count as a coin? No. No, unfortunately. <laughs> um... Hmm. Nothing else? Okay. <laughs> I thought there would have been more on there, but... Yeah. Um, I need the fire flower thing, but it's nice to lead those dooters all together there. Mm, they look all fluffy, but they're really quite spiky, so don't touch them. Alright, you guys are going down! Going down! I need to be close to you to hit you, don't I? <laughs> I am not a sharpshooter with the fire flower. 
Uh, but I can shoot fire flowers all around the planet and create orbiting rings like Saturn! Ish. <laughs> they eventually burn out. So it's not quite the same. Okay, Crabbers. <laughs> do that. You're gonna do that. Oh, you turned the star bits. You cheapskates. <laughs> I don't think there's anything else I can do about that. And one more. Yeah, I don't because I don't think you can ground pound those suckers to get coins out of them or something like that, if I recall correctly. But there's more coins to be had on other planets anyway, so like oh like over here for one thing. Uh five there. Uh, you weren't the toad that I wanted to talk to, because you're you're the pink toad, not the red toad. Yep, same dialogue, so you are not the one. You're not the chosen one. <laughs> Alright, jumping on you. Whoop, not, not that way, I want to ground pound you, I mean. There we go, there we go. Oh, nope, 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 nope. Yeah, so you can't go back for coins, which makes this all the more complicated in some aspects if you think about it. Uh, because, yeah, there's, there's a thing of that, once you go past and hit the checkpoint, you know, yeah, maybe I shouldn't hit that checkpoint too, for one thing, but I'll probably survive since I'm aiming for coins rather than, uh, uh, star bets this time around. Um, yeah, I'm gonna get all the coins I can from these duders too, because remember when you shine the light on them, they vaporize and turn into a coin. I'm just gonna go around and get the coins before they disappear if at all. Oh, I'm at over 20. That's all that I need. I, I All I need is 20 coins. And I can get that coin even on the way out. Nice. Alrighty, and that's the toad ship that I aim to talk to, finally. <laughs> here we go! I'm getting this out of the way, right here, right now. The captain should never be scared, even when surrounded by enemies. I'm just taking a break right now. <laughs> yeah, I'll bet. I'll bet. So actually, you know, I... I didn't really need this, did I? And not at this particular particular moment, but now I think I will, because we're going into a secret boss. So yeah, I got the order of the stars mixed up in my mind here, that's why I grabbed this early. I didn't really even need it. But uh, yeah, well, this is going for the boss, boss, boss. Boss, bossy boss. Uh, wait, wait. You're okay, out there, right? Yeah, no, no problem with, you know atmosphere or anything like that. Mario doesn't need air to breathe, except when he's underwater or something. <laughs> hey, these little planets have just enough atmosphere to survive. Uh, 20, here's your 20! Yeah! That sounded more like Toad than the Hungry Luma. This is a I think we're going to thrift Into a boss planet! Like, literally, a boss planet. He's making a planet and a boss, I, I guess, maybe. I I don't know, maybe this is, wasn't such a good idea after all. But we do have to 100% the game, so we're in it to win it. It's Fiery Cobble Gut! <laughs> and this is why I got uh, the extra lives, because it's very easy to touch one of his flames that are just hanging out on the ground, or accidentally touch his body when you're trying to hit those bulbs on his body with a spin, or bubbles on his body with a spin or whatnot, so it's it's definitely helpful to have a little bit of extra life on this one. We'll see how things turn out. But the, the strategy is pretty much the same though. You just, whoop, ah, that's the issue, and I can't hit that first one. I can hit the second one, the third one, and the fourth one, and go into phase two. <laughs> but yeah, that's, that's the trick to the fieriness, is if you're touched by them, um, you start going out of control and you miss your opportunity, and that can happen quite a lot. Here comes balls of fire! Oh man, camera's well, let's see, camera's getting between him and the oh there we go. Okay, ball, ball, ball. Yes! I gotta lead him around. Get the other balls. Uh, this is this is getting a little tight here. <laughs> oh, I couldn't get those last two. That might be a little trickier than if I if there's gonna be fireball remnants on the ground. Oops. Oh man, you are just... You are rocking this planet. It's just like Goku versus Frieza battle. The whole place is going down. <laughs> uh, okay, here we go. Here we go. Lead him around. Lead him around. That way it'll do. We're looking for the bulbs. One and two. Oh, so close. So close to victory. 
See that extra life coming in handy. Oops, definitely came in handy there. I was gonna say I'm gonna go get that. I'm gonna get the coins to try and replenish that, but I failed. <laughs> oh man! Just ran right into your mouth. Well, I can get get this coin though. I like those apples. You don't like those apples, do you? <laughs> yeah, it's actually a pretty pretty tricky boss because of the whole uh, yeah the whole fiery aspect of things going on around here. Oops! Come on. I just want to recover my health here, and you're not, you're not making things easier on me. I know that's your whole plan, but... <laughs> there I go, I'm back to full-ish. Technically, oh, technically, I'm not quite at full. It's full with six at one point, but... Well, it's... it's um, oh, shoot! It wasn't near where I needed to be. Ah, there's too much stuff going on. <laughs> yeah, like a pro. <laughs> oh, I'll get him, though. This is a tricky boss, but I'll get him. Like, look, look at all this junk, though, that just happened from him just going around the place and just ransacking it. <laughs> Alright, get ready for the sound. It's coming! It's coming! Whoop. <laughs> it's still there. <laughs> yeah! Alright, so that was definitely a very, very different gobblegut battle. <laughs> That was not like what you would see at your typical boss rush where it's just like boss that you played before in the same area, boss that you played before in the same area. Oh no no no, this this gobble guts got a whole lot of different properties. <laughs> Alrighty. So that galaxy is clear. For now. There's a uh prankster comet going there as well, but that will we'll get to that when the time is right. <laughs> this is not the time, I think. But I, there is time, however, for a race. Probably. I think. Well, mm, mm, uh, I think, yeah, I think I'll go for the uh, back over here, because this is back at World 5 at Fleet Glide Galaxy. Guys, we got another race invitation from the Jibber Jays. So here we go. My pointer, fastest feathers in the galaxy. Oh, speaking of pointers, um, I, I do have the chair in a different spot. I just didn't have my arm in the right spot. But um, you know that disconnect thing that I was having with Nunchuck? I looked at the connector pins and uh, so a couple of pins probably from a lot of use, you know, like pushing it in and out over and over and over again, were actually a lot in a lot more shallow. Like they, they weren't they were pushed in rather than sticking out to make a good connection, so I bent them back, and now I'm not having that issue. <laughs> How to glide with fuzzer? Yeah, that's the same tutorial. No dialogue, no dialogue. Okay. Race, race! Alright, it's on! I'm the best there is. Just try me. Never lose a race. You lost the race before, didn't you? Or are you a different Jibber J? Well, okay. It's a showdown, showdown! This one's for real, let's go! Oh, I didn't get his dialogue when, if you ref if you refuse him, but I can always just re-enter that star and see. Alright, so, as I was saying about this place before, it's not quite as scripted as the other one is. As a matter of fact, you probably want to get this. <laughs> it's a little different strategy than when I was going for the gates, but, uh... You know, this is hopefully gonna work in the long run, let's just put it that way. I'll get to that opening, there we go. Oh shoot, that's painful. Oh, but not painful enough to one hit kill me, no? Okay, so, oh! That's also painful, but not painful enough to one hit kill me. Bumping into a thwomp, however, could very well kill me. Uh, okay, there we go. I'm not doing too well here, but maybe I can recover with some dives near the end. Maybe. Oh man, there's our most worthy adversary. I'm gonna try and cut the corners here a little bit. Just like to go more towards the inside here. Okay, there we go. I'm not sure if this is gonna work. He's kinda... Well, he might, might work. He's kinda faltering here. Oh man. Oh man, this is gonna come down to the wire. <laughs> so close. See, not quite like the other one. Little guy, small fry, come on, try, try, that's all you got. Oh, oh, and he kills me. He just shoots me with his words. Well, I guess now's a good opportunity to... Well, I was gonna say, now's a good opportunity to see what he says if I should say no. But you know what? You know what? <laughs> let's see what I... Let's see what he says when I say no. Got it? Good. Okay, so... Once more here. 
I still got the invitation here, and he's not going to relent until he loses. <laughs> yeah, fastest fellers in the galaxy. Yeah. We're gonna say no. Mm -hmm. Quits. What? What? Running away? Too scared? Nope. Okay, this is it's not really that much different than the other one. All right, here I go. One on one. Fluzzard versus Jibber J with Mario Toad. You know, if you think about it, Fluzzard kind of at a semi disadvantage. He's got Mario to carry with him. <laughs> get that, get that. Yeah, there we go. It lost me a little bit more forgiveness. Okay, well, I think I'm gonna take a more direct route this time. I'll just go like straight through here. I don't know if this will work though. It might. Oh, that that did not work at all. <laughs> Didn't work at all. <laughs> I just pinballed. All right, <laughs> don't try that. I guess. Take my initial route. I should not experiment. Well, actually, I should experiment because it comes comes into funny stuff like that. <laughs> oh, I missed it this time. Well, whoop, well, mm, I'm gonna have to get some coins along the way probably to keep myself living. Uh, grab a couple of those, tilt down a little bit more to get myself... That's not good, that's not... Yeah, I did not have the right angle that time. <laughs> I didn't have the right dive or anything there. That's okay, I missed out on my mushroom near the start. <sighs> Go! You notice on this one, though, you do have time to make up any sort of time deficit at the end. Well, up to a certain extent. It's just that I got a little bit too far behind at a certain point due to the hits and stuff like that, so let's try and not do that. <laughs> let's take it super serious, serious Sam time. Whoa, jeez. All right, we're in first place. I'm gonna dive here. I'm gonna try and get past that other thwomp before it decides to thwomp. There we go. Now we're cooking. <laughs> Uh, okay, so now I'm gonna whoop, I'm gonna bounce my face off the ground. That'll that'll do just fine. It's it's there. I'm there to protect Fluffy. That's that's all Mario is there for. Okay, cutting the corners while everything destroys. That's good. And yeah, I'm doing a whole lot better than I did the last time here. And you notice that gate actually comes down, but if you, as, long, as long as you die, you'll get enough speed to actually get past that. And there we go. Beautiful. <laughs> Woo! Much, much better run. Can't believe it! Can't believe it! I'm not good enough to be the leader! You be the new leader! Leader needs a trophy! A trophy! Take the star! Woo! Oh yeah! Any other dialogue before I go? Boss! Boss! We have gained the respect of the Jibber J. Woo! Yeah! <sighs> Hmm. Hmm. Oh, that's. I'm actually at 22 minutes in the park. <laughs> so let's see if there's anything else that's gonna happen here. Galaxy complete for one thing. That's pretty nice. Comet maybe. Oh, there it is. That's the boss rush comet. Oh, Arceus. No. Why? <laughs> well. I'm leaving that for later. Well, actually, do you have any other dialogue because you're saying go get him, Captain? No? No? Okay, well. With that, I'm going to end off the part here, then. I hope you enjoy, and I will see you in the next part when I... I don't know, I guess I'll try that. Prankster Comet. I am going to be probably throwing my Wii Remote into the TV, though, and it's not going to be pretty. <sighs> I'm going to have to go to Amazon and get, like, three TVs as backup for this one. <laughs>